Are you feeling really homesick right now, whether you are off to college or traveling? Let's see if we can help alleviate that in today's video. Hey guys, it's Jasmine and this is Tapping Tuesday. If you are new to EFT or tapping, I strongly suggest that you check out my intro videos first. And you can do that by clicking on the eye icon right up in that corner or checking out the links in the description below. You can also download the free stress relief guide that I created specifically for this series. And you can do that by going to truehealthtrifecta.com backslash EFT. Before we get started, if you like learning new stress management techniques, or if you like cat stuff, things about fitness and nutrition, and whatever else I may feel like posting, please make sure to click that subscribe button below, as well as the little bell icon right next to it, so you can get notified of the new videos that I put out every catter day and Tuesday. And remember, by joining me in this practice, you agree to take full responsibility for your own health, and that includes your physical and emotional well-being. Now, let's get started with today's session. Repeat after me. I am feeling so sad and homesick right now. On a scale of one to 10, how true does that statement feel to you? Let's get starting by tapping on the karate chop point and repeat after me. Even though I am feeling so homesick right now, I accept myself and how I feel. Even though I'm questioning my decisions and miss the comforts of home so much right now, I'm open to feeling happy, thankful, and content. Even though I feel so sad and miss my friends and family so much. I deeply and truly love myself and accept how I feel. This homesickness. This sad, low feeling. I miss my home so much. Such a sad and lonely feeling. I miss my family and my friends. This loneliness. So, so homesick. I just want to be back home. I know that my current location is only temporary. And I know I'll be back home soon enough. but I still feel so lonely. What if I made the choice to make the best of this? What if I ventured out and experienced this new city that I'm in? to meet new people and learn more about the area? And maybe even learn more about myself in the process. So I can go home with all kinds of fun stories to tell everyone.
to share the joy in my life with the people that I care about and who care about me. To share with my family and friends who I love so much. I'm ready to release this sadness and loneliness. And choose gratitude and joy for this experience. I let go of any sadness or doubt from my entire body. And breathe in the excitement to explore and to make the most of where I am right now. I may be away from home, but that just means I get to bring back new, exciting stories. And to be able to share it with those I care for the most. Take a deep breath, have a sip of water, and let's repeat that starting statement. I am feeling so sad and homesick right now. On a scale of 1 to 10, how true does that statement feel to you now? If the feeling is still strong, you can continue tapping until it neutralizes or until a different emotion takes over. Everyone processes things differently, and there's no harm in taking as long as you need in order to feel calmer or better than you did before we started. If you are seeking more personalized coaching or feel like a private consultation may benefit you more, then I will leave a link in the description below with different options that may be of interest to you. If there is something that you are struggling with and you're open to leaving that struggle or stress in the comments below, I may choose it for a future Tapping Tuesday video, so feel free to go and do that. Please remember to click the thumbs up if you liked this video or if it helped you, and also to share it with anybody else who you think it may benefit. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!